we've got a little bit of mulching. Yes, we're at my house. Um, I've got this. Uh, oh, I've got this the cistern down here. Sorry, my cord's all wrapped up. I've got a cistern down there that produces about 360 gallon of water. And once we get down here, you kind of see what's going on. I'm trying to get it. I need to have time to go down and mess with it. And I need to get a drain pipe going out that's below ground and not going in this ditch down there. It's incredibly wet. Um, it's where I used to have a natural spring coming up. I didn't, but the farmer before me did. And then he put this catch basin set up in it. Um, so we're going to use the Osma. I'm going to show you how well this thing mows grass. It's really tall, thick, wet grass. You're going to see how well this mows grass. Um, but I thought I might go through what I do to set this up. So while you're running, you know, you want to... Say your thumbs butt down a little bit. You want to run your thumb all the way up, okay? Throttle down. You have to uh, kill the machine. And let me see. Where am I going to put you guys? To where you can see everything and you might be able to hear me. Nowhere. Okay. How about this? Oh, cord. I got my GoPro plugged in because my GoPros are always dead. So let's put you down here on the step and we'll just go through the process of uh, putting this on. So what I've got, hopefully you can hear me. Give me just a second. All right, factory Yanmar valves take a three quarter inch wrench. Okay, what I'm going to do is you've got your thumb all the way up, so you want to shut your valves off. Alright, both my valves are shut off. And then I just keep this wrench in my toolbox back here. got two or three kinds of lifting chain that I use and all that so and then what we do is you come up put your operate down turn your key to on and just cycle cycle your thumb that just took the pressure off of it okay and then you come back out and you hook up your lines Everybody will be happy. All right, so you've got your valve turned off, and let's just show you. I'll unplug it real quick. So with your valve shut off, all you have is your control circuit here. Um, a lot of people they plumb this wrong. You know, you'll have they'll have their thumb running off of this. Well, your thumb's going to run all the time at that point. So. Your charge circuit comes up, and this is an added feature. Go back through my videos and watch installing a case drain. This is the case drain we put on. Um, it works incredibly well. Um, this doesn't leak anymore. The first couple times we tried it, it leaked. It's because it needed a, ch or a case drain. So go back and watch my video about case drain if you want a case drain on your machine. And I tried to be as in-depth as I could. Um, but with this turned off... There's no more charge going to your thumb here. So all it does is run this when you operate your thumb circuit. I know this is probably a main question that I get from a lot of people asking me, you know, how to how to uh, plumb this up. It, this is this is what you need to do. This is your your auxiliary because you want to be on the top side of your valve. So you can control the thumb and turn the thumb off and just run this when you're running the thumb circuit. So 
I'm gonna run this around to the shop. I'm gonna grease the mulcher, grease the machine because I didn't grease it today before I ran it. I'm at least gonna grease the the you know major part of the sticks. I'm gonna grease the mulcher because it's been sitting outside. And then we're gonna head down there and I'm gonna track along the street and I'm gonna mulch the ditches for my two neighbors because it's basically my water off the property that's screwing their ditches up. So I'm gonna reach in as far as I can and mulch them um, to try to help them out a little bit. And then they can mow their side of the yard because obviously I don't wanna track through their yard. And then I'm gonna come up my hill and I'm gonna mulch everything I can that I can get to. And then we're probably gonna clear out, there's kind of a, a thicket part of the tree. There's a, you know, a, a hard elevation change over there and stuff and all those thick trees. I'm gonna clean all that up while we're over there while we have the mulcher on.